Hello, everybody, and welcome back to a new episode of World Box. So this is actually a new tournament-style map. So it's in a similar vein to the last one. We have to let everybody go and do their thing. There's actually ocean this time, so if you want, we can become seafaring. As well as it's, I think it's 16 versus 16 or 32 versus 32. I don't remember, but there's some, like, crap in the middle here. There's a big old, big old bog, the mud, mud dog and mud bog, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So... It's kind of strange, to be honest. It doesn't look the best, but eh, whatever. So let's just open up these two places and let everybody, let them fight and see what happens. So we're going to go like, yeah. Oops, I did too much. Whoops. Do, do, do. Okay, we're going to do that because we don't want them to go over here yet. Not yet. Luckily, they have a pretty good little ghost cursor here, so I can see exactly how far this needs to go. So, also, uh, one of my videos that is currently not even done processing got copyright claimed. Because I put classical Beethoven music in it, and it got copyright claimed. That's insane to me. I don't understand how that works. How can somebody copyright claim something that that's not even published? Nor is it even done processing. And there's like, nope, that's totally my music. And it's, I got it from a royalty free music website. Explain that one to me. Boss Hoss. A bit upset about it, actually, as you can probably tell. Yeah, I, I don't get it. The, the copyright claim thing seems really predatory. But that's just, you know, me being me. So that's fun. I, I'm, I'm glad that I decided not to do this. It actually kind of, the more and more I think about it, the more and more upset I get about it. So I've had to replace songs. It's an easy fix. But at the same time, it's like, come, come on, come on. Okay, so let's put this shit on. Let's play. I haven't renamed anybody. Oh, the people who I want to win are the Realm of the Ham. I think that would be just a great name. Or the he, maybe, or Vow. Chewy, Pena. These are all randomly generated names, by the way. Not not my not my decision. So it looks what are you oh you're building a dock out there. Oh well, well that's probably not good. You actually shouldn't be able to do that. Let me let me fix that real quick, like right now. Mm-hmm. Mountains. There's a ton of kings being born. There you go. Anybody else living in the ocean? Anybody else? You are for some reason. No, you're not. Okay. Just trying to make sure somebody doesn't have boats because they'll be a little overpowered if they got boats. Okay. Well, these two are actually, everybody's living in, in peace. In harmony, somehow. Got four notifications from email. And my energy bill is due. That's cool. Oh, you know what we need to do? We have, I think I've... It's been a while since I've loaded... Oh, no. Oh, fast cultures, fast city construction. Yep. City fast upgrades, fast city growth. Okay, there you go. Put that all on, just for, just for the funsies of it. So this is it looking like we have it zoomed out. So the Realm of the Ham's probably going to lose. Makes me sad. Come on, you cowards. Declare war on each other. You have seven people. And you have 12 people. <gasps> Realm of the Ham. Come on. You got this, buddy. Realm of the Fadod. Is that like a dad bod, but pharaoh level? Who is going to win? Let me know in the comments below if you have a prediction. After this episode, I have to go check on the other one. See if that's also been copyright claimed. It's just so difficult. It's so hard. Just trying to live my life. It just goes to show, if you, even if you make your own damn music or you look up copyright claim stuff, it's all going to be illegal. Also, who made this map? Like, what is this? I, I got to stop judging. Stop judging. It's not good for you. Okay. So how, how about this? If Y'all have like five minutes or we can just do Sonic Speed. Let's just do that. Wait until people declare war, because now it's going at like 20x or something like that. I don't know. 
Can they declare war on each other? They can. Okay. Oh, should turn rebellions off. Don't want that. Okay. Good thing I... They didn't do anything. Okay. Go. Go to war. Do it. Fight each other. Uh, nope. A bunch of kings are dying from old age, it looks like. Yeah, everybody's king just died. Look at look at that feed. Okay. All right, you're obviously not going to go to war with each other. Rude. So But you were on times 5 speed, yeah. Okay. I hate to do this, but Hopefully, this means that everybody's going to be at war with each other. Oh my god. Okay. As long as you go to war with the people next to you, which you should be. The humans are dead. Oh, I just put some spite in the ocean. Oh, no. Okay, so the Holy Ewig have won. The Vo are getting conquered. The Realm of Light. A realm of the Ham, come on. Come on, Ham. Do it for... Do it for the pigs at home. Kill that king. Hell yeah. Why does this look like it's going so slow? There it goes. Wash is one. The realm. Yes, ham. Woo. Good job, ham. Okay. So we got Edis of the Sun. Pretty close. Oh, I don't have Sonic Speed on still, do I? No, I don't. It's just times five. Okay. So, who? Chewie is still alive. Everybody else is pretty much... Oh, this is going back and forth. So this is... Wow, these are really close. For some reason, you're not killing each other. Just just do it. Just destroy them. Do it. Oh, you know what I should do? I should turn on Angry Villagers. Yes, should I turn on Angry Villagers? Hmm... Yeah, let's do that, actually. Now that we... Okay, we'll turn on Angry Villagers. Okay, so... Everybody has won. Everybody that was everybody that was going to win has won. And so now we're down to... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. We're down to 16. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, that's weird. Okay, so let's open up the floodgates for the next kingdoms here. Congratulations to if your winner has won, if your loser has lost, get fucked. Sorry. <laughs> I thought that would be kind of funny, but nah, probably not. So let's just, yeah, turn this shit up. Yo, Fiddy, hit that switch. All the way turned up. Okay. So. Round two. Fight. Why do you expand? Why do we expand into the ocean, Papa? Because the ocean has fish. Jameson Bradley. I don't know what I'm saying, man. I'm tired. Okay, so. Why do we choose to fight? Oh, yeah, I forgot. The hell is that noise? Everybody's still at war with each other. So who's going to win? How's the ham doing? No, ham. Damn it. God damn it, ham. Why do you have to die? What? How are you out on a... What the fuck? Excuse me? What the hell? <laughs> that was nutty. Okay. So Wash have killed the people I wanted to win. Fuck. Uh, so Wash and Ob are currently winning. Ayas and Pena are still at war. The Vocal, Volico and the Vow are still at war. And that's the only two people that have actually finished their fights. I'm finishing this fight. Oh, and the Imperium have also won. Congratulations. It always seems to be those top ones that seem to win. So this has actually been pushed back a little bit. Although... Oh, yeah, they actually took back their territory. That's surprising. Good for them. 
You have a boat somehow. Why do you have a boat? How did you get out? Yeah, whatever. I don't care. <laughs> it's kind of funny. So the wish you are currently... Well, Pena has just been destroyed, so... The right side has been officially dominated. But they're not expanding. I turned on angry villagers, didn't I? Yeah, because they should have been destroying the, the new settlements. Are you two not at war anymore? No, you are. You're just not killing each other. Strange. Very, very strange. So people who win their wars definitely are going to be an advantage here, obviously. The faster you win, the more you can expand and the better you are for the next round. So like the Val, whoever wins that war, probably the Val, they're going to lose. And then same thing with the Wish You versus the, the Whitey Show. Doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter who wins that because they're just going to get wrecked by the next people. Really, the way to do this, so it would be a little bit more even, would to be, would be having, you know, set times of like, you have this long to win and then I automatically declare a winner. Oh, June 14th's Flag Day. Do I get paid extra on Flag Day? No, nah, I don't know. Why are you, just, just go to war, please, just, thank you. Finish the fight. They don't have anybody. Oh, yes, they do. They got 40 people. No, oh, okay. You're about to lose that. Cool. Good job. Okay, and this war is going to be over. Your king is in the ocean. Okay, where where are you leaking from? What, where's the hole? I don't see it. Okay, so. I. Okay, you your king got demoted. Thank God. <laughs> okay. So. Does anybody else want to expand? We'll put it on times five speed from here on out and let them let the victors possibly expand a little bit. But on sonic speed is any new God damn it. You can't declare peace. This is a, a, a tournament. You can't just like halfway through the game be like, nah, we don't want to play anymore. I know that works. Okay, now let's make everybody go to peace with each other. I hear a lot of fireworks. Anybody at war still? Okay. Why? Why? Why are you here? How did you get there? Stop it. <laughs> okay, whatever. So is everybody expanded? I don't think you will expand any further. Because you can't. Maybe. Okay. Okay, so we'll let them... Kind of just hang out for a bit, take over as much territory as they want. It looks like the Kephi aren't going to expand any further. Okay, so let's turn off Sonic Speed. Turn that off. Put it on times one speed and pause it. And let's open up the floodgates yet again. So go like that. And go like that. Are they going to actually expand? God knows, but I hope they do. So we're down to the final eight, it looks like. All right, one, two, three, four. Yeah, final eight. So, there we go. All right. Let's put it on times five speed. Everybody should be at peace. Now, are they actually going to expand into the new territories? That's the question. I hope they do. Oh, the Holy Ewig declared war on the... Oh, that was quick. Okay, so that naturally happened. And so have the Fadad. Oh, the, I knew the Imperium was going to get wrecked. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. And the Vow and the Iris are still at peace with each other, and so are the Ob. But as of right now, it looks like the Wishu are clear victors in their war. The Imperium are pushing back a little bit. It's about even there as of right now, but I don't see it really going any other way. So, Val has declared war on Iris. Good job. I didn't have to do that one. Now the Wash and the Ob should go to war with each other naturally. Oh, the Val is going to absolutely destroy the Iris right here. It's not... There goes there goes Ob and Wash. Okay. 
There that goes. Okay, let's turn this shit down a little bit. Turn the turn the beat around. The Imperium are actually winning their war. The wish you were in the final four. Let's go. So I want the wash to lose. I want them to get murdered. Murder. Because they killed the ham, which was my vote for the winner. Ooh, that's gonna be a good fight between Oh no, never mind. That's not gonna be a good fight at all. The the wish you are gonna absolutely get freaking wrecked versus the vow next round. I don't see that going very well at all. So Oof. Yeah. Although that, you know, they'll maybe be a little bit even in population because you have to, with angry villagers being on, there's going to be a good amount of people dying in the war. The, the, whoever wins between these two is going to get absolutely destroyed too. Nope, my phone just, or my watch just vibrated for no reason. I love it. I love it when it does that. It's my favorite actually. Ah, man, I don't, I don't see this going well for anybody i just want everybody to have fun that's my stance that's my current political stance oh my pop filter moved okay there we go i used to have a nice setup for that but now i i, I don't it's just i got a new desk so are you still at war yes you are uh and so is the wash is getting destroyed by the ob great this is a stalemate of a stalemate right now the holy Ewig are actually pushing again back. It is just going to be back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. What, what are we looking at in terms of army size? All hail T, that's why you're going to lose right there. Okay, so there's a 50 army advantage for the Holy. And it looks like the Ob have split the wash in half. And the Vow are moving in for the death blow of the Iris. And the Wish You are well ahead of everybody. There we go. This is going to be a difficult conflict to resolve. It looks like they're so evenly matched. Now, this one is, is pretty much over. It just, it's basically until the army moves. Maybe the Imperium wins this? I don't know. It's definitely going to be a hard battle to have. So. This is this is over down here. And this is that first... I think that's the first village. Yeah, that's that first village. So, the Iris are dead. Congratulations to the Vow getting into the final four. You're going to get absolutely wrecked next round. But again, I have been wrong in the past. The Imperium are currently winning? No, they're not. No way. Oh my god, their armies are just getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. Have the Ob won. The Ob have not won, but they're setting an army there right now. And the AI is actually working. Okay, cool. Now, that war might go on forever. Although, this is going to be the most territory that the Imperium have taken. Although... However, I was about to say there is an 88 death stack just sitting there waiting. So, I don't see this going well for anybody. Well, the left side's settled. Everything It's everything besides up here. So this is one, two, three, and then the winner of this is going to be four for sure. Probably. You know, I'm actually going to change your color so you're not the same. There you go. You can be green. You can be like poop green. Okay. Come on. Who's going to win? Somebody's got to win. Please send the death stack. Do it. Don't, don't just let it sit there. Send the death stack. If you send the death stack, you win. Okay, we're going to, we're going to bump this up to times five speed because... Somebody doesn't know how to win. I will start nuking people. <laughs> I'm an angry, vengeful god. I 
I think the Imperium is going to win this. If they win this, if they're able to mill down this army by sending just like multiple ar Ooh, the Imperium's gonna win. No way. I didn't think the Imperium was gonna win this at all. But they just, you know, sent their... No, they're not gonna win this. Yes, they are. They've overtaken them in terms of military strength and overall strength. This is big. I mean, the Holy have a 54-person army just chilling there waiting. They have a 38 and a 47. But they've got more armies coming in from the Imperium. Oh my god, it's just going to be a constant stalemate. The village has been destroyed rather than taking it over. It's just been destroyed. Which is cool, I guess. They could... Oh, they might... Mm, no. Nope, they're just growing their army. Okay, we're gonna might have to do this on Sonic Speed. The Imperium have grown significantly larger, though. And they are actually... Oh, I thought they were about to take that village. Let's go to village level to see what happens here. This is actually the most interesting fight, because it's so even. And I don't get how some people are able to move like that. What the fuck? How are you able to walk on water? Well, they, that's not fair. They have Jesus on their team. Hmm. No, you're not allowed to make peace. No. You can't just give up in the middle of the fight, dude. You have to, you have to, we have to have a, like, an end here. You have to have a victor. And here we go. Here comes the Imperium for the, for the knockout blow. Are they going to get the village? Okay, they did get the village. Yeah, there we go. So the Imperium won. Don't know how they did. I honestly thought they were going to lose that. Good job, Imperium, but you're not going to win the next one. If you do, you'd be the, like, the biggest underdog story in the world because the OB have had, like, literally, literally years to build up their army. The Vow have actually overtaken the Wish You. So it's still one, two, one, two, three, four, I guess now. So... And you're way behind in population size. So, just let's finish this fight. What I'm going to do is after this fight's over, I'm going to end the episode here. And let it actually run for a little bit. So maybe the Imperium can build their forces back up. And, you know, move on with their lives. And kind of win this war. Why are you... Um... Okay, so everybody should be at peace now. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time and make and tell me how I'm doing and everything is going. We'll let it run at times five speed, so maybe they could rebuild their, their population levels up a little bit. Uh, I'll see you next time for the conclusion of this. And have a good rest of your day. Like, comment, subscribe, blah, 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 blah.